cheers good morning guys it's currently friday april 8th it's 12 26 p.m i'm starting the vlog a little bit later because i had my personal trainer this morning and then i need to get a couple of work stuff done and i just finished filming a tiktok brand deal so that was fun also i've been loving my freaking drinks that i've been making i haven't gotten starbucks once since i got it and a lot of you guys in my last vlog were telling me to add all the like cold ingredients before i add in the ice because if you put the ice in right after you do the espresso apparently it makes it more bitter and it kind of like shocks the espresso i started adding the ice afterwards and it made such a big difference it's so freaking good and i'm shocked that i haven't gotten starbucks since i got it <laughs> but it's so good so yeah shout out to you guys because um i had no idea so you guys help me out for real <laughs> okay let's go upstairs this room is so plain we need to do something about it it's been bugging me like this wall is so plain we need to work on this room it's like 30 minutes later i did some light makeup just to get myself together i'm wearing i don't think i ever showed you guys this but jaylen on our two-year anniversary wait was it valentine's day or or two year. <laughs> I hope he's not watching this. One of those, he got me this sweatshirt that has Benji's face on it. And it says Benji. If you guys don't know who Benji is, he's one of my mom's dogs, but he's pretty much my dog. Like he loves me the most and I'm obsessed with him. So he got me this sweatshirt, which is so cute. It's literally him. I'm obsessed. So I'm kind of thinking about getting the like lip tattoo, like the lip blushing. It lasts a couple months because my lips are so pale naturally and I hate it. It makes me look like a corpse. This is me after using Too Faced lip injections and it's still like so pale. So I think I'm gonna look into getting lip blushing, like a lip tattoo. I'm not really vibing with it. So we'll see. I kind of want to like research more about it, but let me know if any of you guys have done that because I'm really thinking about doing it because I look like a corpse. Also, we moved this chair into our bedroom. So this is in the corner. I kind of want to get like a little side table or something. And we also still need to figure out what we're going to do with this wall. Um, there's just like a whole bunch of like plain walls that I'm just like, what are we going to do with you? You know, I need to put some type of lip color on my lips because they're so white we'll put this on just to get like some type of color my mom's lips are the same exact way like hers might even like be paler than mine but that's why she always wears red lipstick we got some type of color on i was going through footage the other day and i like turned my head and i could see like a line and i'm like absolutely not that is not it so i'm trying to like make sure there's nothing there yeah today i was going for like the clean girl look so i have like my hair in a slicked back bun i have a um, mask in my hair so i just put that in a bun i just did light makeup and yeah we're vibing whenever i think of like the clean girl aesthetic i always think of like hailey bieber she just looks so clean i don't know how to describe it it just she just looks like she smells good weird i don't know this morning i filmed a tiktok brand deal and it's with i'm so excited i'm working with fenty skin also this is not sponsored i'm just fangirling because i love fenty skin so they sent me a whole bunch of their new like refills and stuff. I am obsessed with this butter drop. Is that how you pronounce it? This butter drop is so good. I oh my god. So I filmed that TikTok this morning and it was super fun. I did like an ASMR thing. I'll include it right here. <laughs> So that was so cool. I'm becoming like a little TikTok star. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm trying to post a lot more on TikTok. It's so fun to post on TikTok and I'm literally on there for hours. So follow me on TikTok. But that was like my first like big brand deal on TikTok. I'm so excited. <laughs> I also ordered some organizers for these drawers. I think they come in tomorrow. But yeah, I'm excited to like go through all this and like organize my makeup because I hate having it in that makeup bag. It makes my makeup so like dirty and messy. Um, So I'm excited to like organize this. It's definitely Definitely needed because I have so much PR makeup in here and I want to like organize everything I think I also have a whole bunch of like hair and skincare products So I definitely need to go through that and get like organizers because it's been bothering me so much Jalen like two weeks ago made a comment about how I haven't worn this sweatshirt yet I always wear the same freaking sweatshirts like every single day for like a week straight I feel like once I go downstairs, he's gonna say something. So let's see if he says something <laughs> you got the Benji <laughs> I told 
told them you were, you were gonna say something about me wearing it. Yeah, you're wearing it. Wearing Do you like it? it? Of course. I knew he was gonna say something. So cute. Last weekend, Jalen and I went to like this local spiritual store that we get like our sage from and stuff. I originally wanted to go there to get an evil eye bracelet just because you guys know this year has been so like negative. Ooh. A fly was like going sideways in our living room. Anyways, you guys know this year has not been very positive for me. It's getting a lot better. Like I'm feeling a lot better mentally. I mean, I still like am struggling and stuff. We end up going there because I want to get an evil eye bracelet because I've heard a lot of like amazing things about the evil eye and like all of that. These kind of remind me of the evil eye, especially this one. So we went there and they didn't have any like evil eye bracelets. So I ended up ordering one from a small business on Etsy. So I'm really excited because I need this on me immediately also when we went to that local store um i got this like crystal rock that's for positivity and to like attract positivity and when i was checking out she um actually gave it to us for free which was so sweet and i was just like oh my god so nice i got a bracelet this is so cute packaging love it's super dainty which i love and i only wear like gold jewelry so i got this gold one and it has like one evil eye on it there is another one that had like 10 evil eyes around it but i wanted something more simple so this is very cute i'll link it down below but i also heard i don't know if this is true but it was on tiktok this one a girl said that if you drop or if your evil eye bracelet breaks you need to like replace it with a new one because apparently um it caught all of that like negative energy and like ended up breaking or i don't know how to explain it but the way she explained it i was like whoa this seems Seems pretty intense so all the positive good vibes please come to me and to you guys <laughs> yeah look how cute it is i'm obsessed it literally looks exactly like that also this is the store that i got it from ddly dig jalen's putting it on because um <laughs> i was like does it not fit i think i might order a smaller size because there's like a big gap and i don't want it to like move around so much you know here's what it looks like i think it's so cute i think i am gonna order a smaller one because this is like too big this is like like one of their smallest sizes. Fun fact, my wrists are so tiny. I also just got a package from Amazon, so let's open her. Okay, well, that's boring. <laughs> I was running out of my face wash, so I ordered a new one. Not very exciting, but this stuff is so good. Hi guys, so it's actually a couple days later. It's, I almost said February 11th. It's April 11th and it's 3.38 p.m. I just got a whole bunch of like work stuff done. I had a brand deal TikTok that I had to finish. I had a man channel brand deal that I had to finish. And what else did I have to do? Oh, I needed to take an Instagram picture. So I took some Instagram pictures for Instagram. So I got a lot of like content stuff done. Jalen also just got off work. He took a shower. Oh my God, your eyes look so red. I know, they've been irritating me like the past couple Dude. Guys, he got pink eye. Uh. He got pink eye. Uh. Only if you... <laughs> Only if I farted. Babe, you were farting a lot last night, so it was probably from that. <laughs> Right now we're going to go run some errands. I need to go to Target and I need to go to the container store. I'm doing like this spring cleaning video on my main channel. I don't think it's up by the time you're seeing this. I need to get a whole bunch of like organizing containers. I ordered some on Amazon and they turned out to be so freaking small. I was like, I can literally only fit like one beauty blender in one container. Like not even kidding. I don't even know what people use it for, but I had to return it. So we're gonna go to the container store and get a whole bunch of containers. Babe, what's up with you? Not People much. are asking how you've been uh, with yeah, everything been, going on and I've just been chilling. Uh, come here. No. <laughs> been right. I've been you, yeah. Been getting by. Yeah. Do you have anything to say? No, I just hope everybody's fine and well. Yeah. Just brushing out the beard. Guys, also he his eyes are red because they're irritated. He's not high or anything right now. <laughs> also, it's been so freaking nice to not have to wear a mask when you're at the stores and stuff because I feel like when I put a mask on, it's just my makeup's instantly like ruined. So it's been so nice to like go to Target and not have to wear a mask, but still be safe, right babe? Oh yeah, just don't be around people you don't know like that. Egg. Keep it exactly. distant still, but enjoy yourself <laughs> freely. So many of you guys have been tagging me in the freaking Skippy peanut butter thing. I'll include the TikTok. Foods that have been recalled in 2022 so far.
All right, first on the list is Skippy Peanut Butter. They recently recalled over 9,000 cases of their reduced fat, crunchy, and creamy peanut butter. That batch may contain small fragments of stainless steel. So yeah, apparently there's like metal pieces. I think it was metal pieces in the Skippy Peanut Butter. Of course, it's the reduced fat one that you guys know I am obsessed with. I literally eat it every single day. So when I saw that, my heart like sunk. I was like, what? But then I did more research and it wasn't any of the Skippy Peanut Peanut butters that were in Washington. When I researched about it, it didn't have our state on the list, so all good. I don't have any of the peanut butters that are recalled. Thank goodness. I'm like, I don't need another thing to worry about this year. So we're all good, but be safe if your state is listed on that like website thing. I'll like include a picture, but yeah. This peanut butter is literally the best. Usually I have like 10 in the pantry, but I only have two. But when I saw that, I was like, are you kidding? Come on. And Skittles came out with these sour Skittle gummies <laughs> a couple weeks ago. Jalen went to like five grocery stores looking for them. Was he like, was on I was like a three hunt. QFCs. Oh my god, he was not giving up. Hey, I bought like four packs. They're so good. Too. Better than sour patches. Oh, I thought those ones were open. I was like, no. those ones get open. Yeah, these ones, they're for sure better than sour patches. This is his little candy aisle. <laughs> Okay, we made it to the container store where we're walking up to right now. La, la, la. Okay, this one's cool because you can like remove the dividers and like customize it. So I think we should definitely get this one. The store stresses me out. There's just so many containers. I don't even know where to start. Jalen's vibing with the song. So far we got two of these containers and then two of the like adjustable customized ones. I was thinking about getting one of these for the makeup room, but I don't like the color of this. Maybe the gray one, I don't know. You guys know I love white, but maybe having white with my makeup in it isn't a good idea because it's it'll get really messy. So I'm not sure. Sick, so sick. I also already ordered like these grip things um, on Amazon, so I won't need these, but this is just for, so the containers don't slip. That is my biggest ick. Okay, I need one of these for my cleaning video. Oh, this is really hard. <laughs> I don't want to drop it. Oh my god, these would be perfect for the laundry detergent. These are so cute. Oh my gosh. These are adorable. Which size? I feel like the smaller one, right? Because you don't need that much. We also need a soap brush and we love these ones. So I think we're going to get this one because it has a holder with it too. I saw this on Shark Tank and I remember the judges being so like hard on him. But now look at him. He's literally in like every store. Scrub mommy. Oh my god, I just realized Blue Land's here and this is the company that's sponsoring the cleaning video for my main channel so shout out to them <laughs> okay I think we got everything we need now we're gonna go to Target, Target. Oh my god, I thought this was like a mini washing machine for your beauty blender, but it's just a trash can. Okay, I just need to get it. <laughs> Sorry, I was waiting for that guy to leave. I need to get some of those like detergent beads for the cleaning video because I need like refillable. Now we'll get two of these. Boom. <laughs> I saw on TikTok that Ben and Jerry's came out with um, puppy cups, but I don't see them anywhere. Stop! Gosh! He keeps barking. I've checked at every like grocery store, but they don't have them at ours yet. <sighs> Tragic. We're gonna try this mushroom and truffle oil pizza. We've been loving truffle lately. That's our shit. Just put that stuff in the car. Now we're stopping at Restoration Hardware Outlet because this is new. I didn't even know they had one over here. So we'll see if they have any furniture that's white. You guys know how Jalen feels about white furniture. Dang, they have a lot of stuff here. Ooh, I think the cloud couch is over there too. Yup, this is the cloud couch. This is nice. You're stuck. This is nice. Yeah, it is. I feel like I'm like sinking in. 100%. This would definitely get so dirty. Yeah, this is cozy. This couch is huge. Like it's, I don't know if you guys can tell how long it is, but it is huge. Oh my God. Okay, it's originally 26,000, but it's 17,000 here, which good discount, but damn. 17,000 for a couch. And these kind of chandeliers always remind me of scary movies. Also, this one's so cool. Kind of like Whoa, yeah, that one's really cool. I like that. 28. Little 2800. And they have some good stuff here, but very, very expensive. No bueno. Okay, just got home. Jalen's on my new uh, workout bike, and I have to show you guys. 
Absolutely not. Oh my god. Ignore the garage. It's literally a mess from the PR unboxing that I did in the last vlog. And then my dad set up the bike. Sorry, I don't like to break down boxes. I hate breaking down boxes, so it's Jalen's job. I don't want to show this bike when there's like a mess in the background, but I got this new cycling bike, so I'm super excited to start like using it. It's very cool. It has this huge screen. It's so cool. I'm very excited. I haven't won on it yet, but my dad set it up like yesterday. So very pumped for it. It's like a cheaper version of the Peloton. Yes, very excited. This is the drawer liner that I was talking about that I got from Amazon. You guys pretty much saw what we got. The downy pebbles smell so good. I got this. Whoa! Oh my god, did you see that, that catch? Um, I'm planning on putting it in here and doing like an ASMR TikTok with it. Um, and this scooper is so cute. We got the sponge. I grabbed some beef jerky, the teriyaki flavor, because it's so good. You guys saw the pizza, and then I got a whole bunch of these organizers. Also, I'm intentionally not cleaning the dishes because I'm saving that for my cleaning video tomorrow. So that's why there's dishes and it's really bugging me. I hate when the dishes are full. Um, but yeah, that's what we got. Trying to figure out what we're gonna have for dinner, but um, on Saturday, Jalen and I like went out with friends, which is so, we never go out, we're such homebodies. Um, and I haven't drank in so long. Like the last time that I got drunk was May, 2021 when we went to Hawaii. So I literally had like one drink and I was like feeling it. Um, so I ended up having, I think it was two drinks and one shot of tequila and the next day I was so hungover. I'm like, I do not miss that feeling. The Sunday scaries, are the worst that's how i was feeling yesterday but thankfully i feel much better today but oh my goodness i love drinking but like the next day is just ruined because of the hangover so yeah i was gonna vlog yesterday but i was hungover so <laughs> i get a couple comments sometimes like here and there they're like sorry do you have like friends like you never show friends in like vlogs i do have friends but i don't like vlog when i'm hanging out with friends um but i will be vlogging this week i'm actually going on a girl's trip with my friend kaylee and emily so that will be fun. We're going to the ocean. So the next vlog that you see, you'll see friends in that vlog. So yeah, I do have friends, but I'm such a homebody and I don't like go out as much. But right now I'm trying to figure out what we're gonna have for dinner. I'm not really sure. This is our like everyday struggle of like trying to figure out what we're gonna have for dinner. Oh yeah, also, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I don't have my evil eye bracelet on anymore. I actually give it to my mom because it fit her wrist a lot better. And then I ordered a smaller size. So that comes in this week. So my mom and I will be twins. Oh, I just ran up the stairs, but it's currently 7 34 p.m. right now We just got back from my parents house and we had dinner over there lately Okay, I know this is so weird, but I have been having a weird obsession with like crushed ice Like I don't know what it is, but I can't stop eating it. I looked it up on google like what that means It's a very intense craving of crushed ice. It's so weird. It's never happened to me before fun fact Apparently if you are craving and chewing ice, it's often associated with an iron deficiency with or without anemia, which makes total sense. I had to get a whole bunch of blood work from everything that was going on the past couple of months and I'm like basically anemic. So that makes sense why I'm literally craving crushed ice. It's so random, but I recently had to start taking these like iron supplements or vitamins. So hopefully that helps because I've been like tired 24 seven. Whenever I stand up, I literally feel like I'm gonna like pass out. Yeah, low iron sucks, but where are my iron deficiency people at? It is such a weird obsession lately the sound is awful it sounds like i have like a hollow head if jalen was eating crushed ice i would not have it because i hate the sound of people like eating so i'm like annoying myself when i eat this <laughs> oh my god i look a mess <laughs> i was on tiktok for a little bit but right now i'm just gonna get ready for bed i'm gonna take my makeup off am i the only one that misses makeup wipes like i feel like everyone's on the whole like cleansing balm wave but i just love good old makeup wipes am i the only one i just like love these so much and i know they're probably not the best for your skin but i just like hate the feeling of the like the makeup melt bombs i just like i don't know what it is it just like <sighs> I don't know. I just feel like I'm like rubbing in my makeup. It just makes me feel like, I don't know. Um, so I pretty much switched back to makeup removing wipes, but these are the, the micellar water ones. So hopefully these are a little bit better than the like Neutrogena makeup wipes. Yeah, I can't be the only one. I feel like these are just so much easier and just, I don't know. But I'm just gonna take my makeup off and 
probably hop in the shower to wash my face. I always do this at nighttime. Like there's something about like washing your face in the shower compared to like washing your face in the sink. Like I hate when water gets up my elbow. I have so many like icks, <laughs> like when it comes to like taking my makeup off and like washing my face. I will literally take a full shower instead of washing my face in the sink. I don't know. I just like <laughs> can't deal with like water going down my arm when I'm washing my face in the sink. It just, well, oh. I'm gonna take off my makeup, probably watch uh, H3 podcast and chill with Jalen, watch a show and then go to bed. But I love you guys and I will see you in the next vlog. Also, I hope you guys are doing amazing. Let me know how you guys are doing below. But yeah, okay. I love you guys. Bye.